Hey guys, it's Friday. I'm starting up another vlog. I actually released this week's Disney World vacation vlog today by accident instead of releasing a regular vlog. There are so many videos in my queue right now ready to go that I'm confused. But anyway, whatever. Um, but yeah, starting up another vlog. This will be my Friday, Saturday, Sunday vlog if you're new to my channel. I have been following a Monday, Wednesday, Friday vlogging schedule. And in those vlogs, I do two to three days. And then currently running Disney World vacation vlogs on Sundays. So four videos a week, although maybe this week they'll be five because I should put up a, a, my last vlog before I went on vacation tomorrow, which is Saturday, which you guys will have already seen. People get confused. These, um, I'm about a week ahead on my vlogs because we were like, I thought you were here or there. Where about? No, I'm a week ahead. So as you are watching this now, it's actually last Friday. Okay, so I am off to some garage sales, which I don't normally go to, but um, it is Mother's Day weekend. There isn't much going on. There are no uh, state sales uh, tomorrow, so I thought, well, there's a handful that are nearby. I'll go check them out. Uh, Papa's not feeling well. He's got a really sore shoulder today, which happens with his arthritis, so I can't be gone for too long, um, but I've got him set up with the heating pad and pain pills and drink, and he's got puppies on his lap, so he should be good for a while. So I'm gonna head on out, see if I can find anything to uh, resell on eBay and Etsy. All right, I'm back from the garage sales. I actually did okay. I spent $73, so I'll show you what I got in a minute. Um, but first, I have four eBay orders. Uh, this is a little Maurice's top. It sold on auction for $5.99, and the buyer paid $3.99 shipping. This little loft blouse, I took a best offer of $12, free shipping. This is a Boyd's mug. Um, it sold for $7.99, buyer paid shipping. And then a set, well, a lot more like, of these um, Franciscan plates. Um, I've got a salad plate and three uh, bread plates in one lot because they're just odds. Um, and they sold for $31.99 uh, with the buyer paid shipping. Is that a good Kong, Lucy? Where's your Kong, Charlie? Did you finish it? Where's your Kong? Where's your peanut butter Kong? Peanut butter Kong? Where's your Kong? <laughs> All right, guys. Here's what I picked up today. Several Polo Ralph Lauren. I did pay up for this one. I mean, five bucks is more than Goodwill would charge. Um, but it is a XL, and it has the big pony. Then another Ralph Lauren sweatshirt. This was a an extra large no two XL tall another two XL tall polo and then two X B which I guess is two extra large tall and two extra large B I'm not really sure the difference but I'll figure it out so I got those I got a troll doll I got this it's a vintage walking Santa Claus this was only a quarter this is a ceramic pumpkin it's got some age to it and then it was filled with all kinds of other little random stuff that I need to dig out and that was only a buck some hats I will get a hat if it's cheap and clean these were 50 cents this is a Thomas Kincaid holiday wreath I haven't even plugged it in yet um, I've sold the tree before I got to check because there are little parts that are easy to flip off on this make sure it's complete check the comps if, it, if I find out it's not worth on eBay, I'll take it to the consignment store. Little, just a collectible plate. It was a quarter. A couple little vintage figurines. We've got Jesus, which you don't see. Well, I shouldn't say you don't see adult Jesus, but usually, you know, the nativity, it's baby Jesus. So there's that. Then this was made, it's Mary of plastic, but she is marked. And again, they were a quarter. I'll get a Beanie Baby if they're 25 cents with the tags. These were just little Halloween ones. They're all the same. Another um, Royal Copenhagen plate. I have so many of those, which is fine. I picked up this. Um, it's Anchor Hawking Fire King because it was blue. I got the blue one. And this is a coffee mug from 1993. Hi, Papa. Hi. I'm doing a little haul video because okay. you don't feel well. Are you feeling any better? No. I don't, I'm not sick, it's just my arm hurts. Yeah. Why that does, I don't know. Well, I'll amputate after the video. Okay. Then this is a ornament from, an ornament from Dillard's, but who knows. A couple of these music boxes. 
Made in Japan. Lots of Francoma. I got an eBay seller who was quitting. <laughs> I got the Francoma duck. Oh, yeah. So that's exciting. This is disgustingly dirty, but. Yeah. And then just this random bag of toys. Because I can't pass up toys. These are not the vintage Smurfs. These are the newer things. But I'll look in there and see what we got. So when you're feeling better, Papa, you can clean them up. Okay. And then I got these for myself. So Smurf cute. Smurf. They're just little candle holders. Smurf. Smurf. Yeah, they're the new Smurfs, though. Are they any good anymore? Not, well, not even the old Smurfs. The old Smurfs are like $3.99 a piece. But, you know, I don't know. I have a whole bag. I should just list them for like $9.99 each free shipping. they probably sell that way. A bag of them? No, one Smurf at a time. Oh. As I have all those little ones that I got a couple years ago, yeah. I tried selling them in a lot and they just sat. Yeah. But if I do them individually, they will sell better that way, but it's a pain in the butt, but... Might as well, trying to build up our store. Right, Lucy? Lucy is really loving her peanut butter Kong. Charlie seems to have lost. Oh, that's Charlie's. Lucy took Charlie's. I don't know where Lucy's went. Oh, dear. Charlie, can you find Lucy's Kong? Oh, it's on, it's on the couch. It's on the couch. Hey, guys. It's Saturday morning, and I'm out at some garage sales. I had an auction pickup this morning. Then I went to a church sale, got some Fontanini there. I was excited about that. And now I'm at a neighborhood sale. This is like the rich area of my city. Um, or what's considered the rich area. There's some, but this is like the new one. Um, anyway, they have a big neighborhood sale every year, but it's a really big development. So it's not like, I mean, there's hundreds of houses back here and maybe 30 are having a sale. So you definitely have to drive around. But anyway, I just got here and pop out and see what I can get. Okay, so it's now... Um, Saturday after lunch, back from the garage sales. I'll show you what I got in a bit. Papa's napping in the living room. That's where the stuff is. Um, I didn't get terrible amount at the garage sales. I think there were only maybe 10 sales in that whole development. It was really cold today, or it is really cold, and it's been raining off and on. So I think a lot of people just decided not to do it. Um, but uh, these are the eBay sales I've had thus far this morning. This little Culver's plush keychain. Um sold for $19.99. I did have free shipping on it. I sold the one of the skateboard rainbow 80 scrapbooks. I wanted more for this, but they've been sitting, sitting, sitting. And the reason being is the shipping is high. Like this is going to be a three pounder to ship. And I know that turned off a lot of people. Um, I do have another one, but I'm kind of thinking of keeping it. <laughs> Um, but this one sold for $18 um, and the buyer paid shipping. And then just some clothes. I'm not going to tell you the price on the clothes because every single price is different. Um, a Marisa's top. I know that this was an auction item and the buyer paid shipping. And then these two were buy it now. Another Marisa's top. And then this just mellow yellow Coca-Cola shirt. Um, these two were best offer free shipping. So still waiting for a couple other people to pay. I had to file an unpaid Bitter claim on one person. Who? This is what I hate. When someone makes an offer, you accept it, and then they don't pay. I'm like, really? But anyway, um, I my allergies are out of control today. I just took two Benadryl. I know I'm about ready to fall asleep, so I'm going to take a break with that. And then, um, like I said, later on, I'll show you what I picked up this morning. Hey, guys. It's now Sunday. <laughs> I still haven't gotten around to showing you the garage sale stuff. I know. That's because... It's just been busy around the house. Papa's not feeling well, so I'm taking care of him. His arm is hurting. And um, it's actually so started to clean some of the stuff, so stuff's all getting mixed together. So um, I'll show you a little bit of it that's in my room here. Uh, but I have had two sales so far this morning. I took a best offer of 11 bucks for this little Victoria's Secret pink top, free shipping. And then on Etsy, set of the three uh, Poppy Trail sauce bowls sold for $31.99 and the buyer paid shipping. Um, let's see. See, some of this stuff I know I already showed you. Uh, I can't, I think I showed you that. See, my dad put them in here clean. Um, see, I think I'm almost sure. Well, no, I don't know. It's Francoma Bowl, Royal Copenhagen. Um, this I got yesterday. I know I didn't show you. 
I don't know if this is anything. I think it might just be um, Ozark. Oh, what do you call it? Souvenir shop type thing. But it was 75 cents. And again, if it's not worth anything, I'll take that to the consignment store. I did get a couple teacups yesterday because they were so cheap. This is a, it's a March birthday one. And it is, oh dear. Papa washed them and it washed the ink right off of the sticker. Crap. Oh, I can still read it. I could, I, I'll still be able to read it. You can't read it on camera. Then this is just um, a made in Japan one, but this is like the worst haul ever. I'm sorry. Like I said, everything just got shoved together. Um, just a little, oh, that is a chip. No, it doesn't. Oh, that's just a scuff of the paint. Again, it was just super cheap. It's kind of unique with the footed um, little feet there on the cup. So I got those yesterday. I got two of these Disney um, Alice in Wonderland teacups and saucers. And I think, did I get this yesterday? No, I got that the day before. Yeah, this is all stuff I already showed you from um, Friday. So, um, like I said, the rest of the living room area getting cleaned up. So I will show you that before this video um, is over. Okay guys, I know this is like horrible lighting, but um, we just got back from having dinner out for one of my nephew's birthdays and Papa's getting ready for bed. He's having a lot of pain in that arm, so just helping him um, get some pain meds going and get him settled. So I just wanted to still do a quick haul from the rummage sale stuff from yesterday. Um, got a couple bags, this is a fossil. And then this is a leather, what is this? Um, lat oral? I don't know, but it was leather. And then these two are like out of their minds. I got a Fisher Price schoolhouse. I got some, um, got a Hummel plate, Norman Rockwell. These are some things I got at auction for like a buck. Super cheap. Some little figurines. And sorry, all the band-aids. I've got cuts all over me. We're a hot mess over here, people. Hot mess. Some of these little just figurines, a little Hummel. I don't know. Just like little random, random cheap stuff. <laughs> then over here, see if I can get some light going. Not much, sorry. Um, bunch of little perfumes. I just thought these were cute. You know, quarter Disney cards. Little vintage uh, grandma ba grandma's brag book. Never used. More Hummels, clean couple of the big ones. This is another figurine. Um, the auction. I don't ever, I don't, you know, with collectible plates, if they're cheap, I'll get them. Just, you never know. These are the Fontanini Wiseman figures I got. Couple of, and okay, I'm sorry if I've, the stuff I got Friday got mixed in with Saturday. So some of this you may have seen. I'm sorry guys, it's just been a mess around here this weekend. I'm so confused. Um, yeah, I think I showed you this stuff was from Friday, yeah. Um, more stuff from the online auction. I got a lot of these um, Anri, Anri figurines, which are worth quite a lot. So I decided to get those. Uh, there's some more Hummels in there. And then we go into the office where we have more of those Henri figurines and then some more Hummels. So, um, yeah, I know I didn't really do a proper haul. Show you everything in detail again, I'm sorry. It's just, at this point, I'm starting to get backed up as you can see, which again is fine. I know I've said this on Instagram. I don't know if I've said it on here, but I'm okay right now with creating a bit of a backlog because I wanna make sure that once winter comes, I have enough stuff to list when there are no estate sales because I ran out of hard goods this past winter and I had to get more in clothes. I'd like to have more hard goods. So if I can't process everything right away, I'm okay. I don't wanna have an entire room hoard, don't get me wrong, but I do wanna save you know, some like 
small things back. So I'm okay with having a bit of a backlog as long as I have good inventory, sellable stuff that I know um, will turn a good profit and that I can get up um, eventually. And a lot of this stuff will be long tail, which I know I've been talking about too is okay. I just really want to build my store. I did. Did I finally get up to 1,100 listings? I may have. I'm not sure. Two sales today, but it was Mother's Day, so what can you do? Um, but anyway, uh, the week ahead, I only there's only one appointment. Thank God. If Papa can get to feeling better, that would be great. I'd have more time to work. But if he isn't, he isn't. I got to take care of him first. So we shall see what the uh, week brings. But anyway, if you guys like this vlog, I hope you'll give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Bye.